In this video, I will show you a really nice and easy to use and also fast to download and open source, so totally free software, which is Raw Therapy 5.8. This is the version that you are looking at. So with this uh, software, you can easily bring in photos from your pictures from your computer and you can use a bunch of editing tools uh, to modify them and well, perhaps uh, improve them or also create some strange effect or black and white effect as you see here in this example. So let's start from the beginning because I want to show you where you can get it, how you can download it and install it and so on. So let's start by going into, well, uh, first of all, I want to show you the picture that I have used right here, which is from this uh, author and the website, it's called pexels.com and you can use this to download free pictures and videos and other stuff. So if you're looking for something in particular, you can look for, for it here and you can uh, use it. So for example, I can look for people and I have a bunch of pictures totally free that I can download and use it in uh, all the applications that I want. So I will get back to this later. Let me show you how to get uh, this raw therapy software. And to do this, we can just type raw therapy and be careful not with the epsilon, but with the double E, not this. Well, you can get there as well, as you can see. And this is the uh, presentation in uh, Google search. So it's um, a software for processing product photographs and it has a lot of uh, subsets of image editing, operations, uh, non-destructive, post-production, raw photos, and so on. And similar tools, similar software are uh, Darktable and GIMP and Adobe Lightroom, also Photoshop in part. And so if you want to, have, if you want to see other uh, video guides about similar tools, you can check in our YouTube channel, if you already made that. So just go here to JBD Tube, which is our channel, and you can search for, for example, dark table, and you will surely find something. There you go. So you have a uh, video guides in Italian and in English. Of course, you want to check the English version right here. And also we have a lot of videos and a lot of other video courses. You can check our English video courses right here on the top. So be free to explore also our channel. So let's get back to Raw Therapy website. So we can click here in the main uh, result, the top result, and there you go. So you already can download for Linux, Windows, Mac. We have lots of operative system. We can also have a look to the source code. Since this is open source, we can participate, we can donate, we can do something if we want. Otherwise, if you want to just download it, just cl click on the download link. And this is the software right there. I have already downloaded, but you can download it within minutes. It's not a big software. This is the sites right here. So once you do that, you just double click here. And well, yeah, I don't want to substitute that because I already have it. You double click and you do a really quick, quick wizard and it will ask you where to down, where to install it and uh, you know basic things so i will not show you all the wizard which will be boring so you just go forward 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 on the wizard and after that you should see if you want it the the shortcut on the desktop or otherwise you can go here and this, this is the latest software that i have installed which is of course a road therapy so let me just close this page so that we can start from the beginning. So I will just click here. If you don't find it there, you can also look for it in the start menu. Search right down here at the bottom. Okay, there it is. So double click or sorry, just one click. If you are opening it from the start menu, just have to wait a little bit and it should open into really uh, really fast 
And the first time, I remember that I didn't see anything here, just like that. So I, I saw something like this, totally gray. So the first thing you want to do is to locate your folder where you want to work. So if you have, for example, a folder where you store uh, all the pictures uh, or perhaps for or a single project, you just have to locate that folder on your computer, whether it's in your operative system hard disk or your other hard disk. You just go there and locate. In my case, I want to locate the download, the Windows download folder. So I go here to the operating system and I go to uh, users and J, which is my name. Well, not this initial or my name and documents. Uh, sorry, downloads. Yeah, there you go. Of course, I can store into images or documents or other photos, but this is where I store usually my uh, downloaded picture. And you can see here, this is the picture that I have downloaded and already modified. So let's do another example with another uh, picture from Pexels. So I will go back to the Pexels website and choose a nice picture and download it. This is really amazing because it has a lot of really wonderful pictures and we already made other video guides about pexels.com or other similar website just search for uh, free download pictures in my youtube channel you will find other videos so okay so i was looking for some inspiration i find this really nice picture of uh, someone probably doing like photo editing or something like that on a laptop so i can this is the order right here so thanks and i can also choose the quality and you can see here we have also 4k quality but in this case i just need a uh, small pictures to work with you for just for an example so i will get this full hd this is enough and i will click here on free download and save this right here i can donate i can make some advertisement for uh, this uh, author on instagram but in this case i think my video it's uh, just a uh, good advertisement so now the image is downloaded right there i can see it on the bottom left so if i go back into road therapy there you go i i see this picture directly inside without doing anything. So I just can now double click on this and this will open up the image. And now I can start to work with this. So, well, let's see a little bit how the interface is uh, composed. So right here in the left uh, stripe, the left um, toolbar, I have the possibility to change uh, from like a browser where I can get other pictures I have this like source code uh, interface and I have this modify uh, or editing uh, way uh, to see my interface. And this is in Italian, I'm, I've just noticed. So I want to change this. Now I can uh, access the preferences for this software. I go right here on the top, on the bottom and I can see this icon right here, like looking like uh, a mixer and I can click here, this is the preferences and uh, on the general settings I should see here in the language let me uncheck this and select the language and not Italian I want to do this in English well let's make it US for this video okay and well I don't see anything happening so let me try to close it and open it again Okay, so let me now reopen it and thanks to Artim again for your picture and let's, there you go. Okay, so we have now the English uh, interface and this is called editor, uh, file browser, queue and well, let's get into the editor. This is what we are interested in. And this is just an introduction for this software. If you want me to make more videos about this software or similar software, just can write some comments and support us in the YouTube channel. You can support us by subscribing, of course, leaving comments and spread the word. And if you can, you can leave a little donation on this PayPal link right here in the community page or in the store. We have a little bit of merchandising. So let's get back 
to the interface and how uh, well here we can we don't see anything actually so I have to reload that picture that I want there it is now that I have connected my my download folder I can select the picture directly from here so double click and this is my picture right there so uh, I have this toolbar right here on the left I have a toolbar uh, right here just uh, down below the um, this gallery this scrolling gallery and I have a lot of tools here uh, also well also this is really nice this is the histogram which show us information about the image about the, the blues the green the reds and other stuff and uh, this here it's uh, well we could say this is the main toolbar because we have a bunch of uh, essential tools for example I can open up and close different parts of the interface thanks to this these uh, guys here these um, little icons okay I can close and open also right here I can make it full screen and what we have here we have this panning tool which is handy I can click and drag with my left uh, mouse button if I want to make like a zoom I can scroll the scroll wheel and this will give me a nice zoom in and zoom out with the scroll wheel and also we have color picker other stuff here well I don't have time to, to show you everything but again if you support us we can make other videos about this also we can rotate for example this is simple and we can also mirror simple as well mirror up and down and so on and let's go to this other part on the right where we have a lot of panels here and these are the effects and the editing tools that we can use with all their parameters and right here at the bottom we have other nice and important tools for example we can save when we finish to work and we can also zoom here with the plus and the minus and we can zoom to fit and we can also zoom one uh, one uh, on one which means this is the actual size of this image in pixels so we can see it at 100 percent in this case we are 50 percent in this case okay so now let's see some really quick editing stuff so i want to first of all this is a, another really interesting tool also you can see the various shortcuts for example in this case shift b and in this uh, example i can uh, split the screen into two uh, parts the, the the left part is the B4 and I can also lock this to see this uh, fixed and without changes in the other part the right part we can see the after so after I apply some of these editing tools so let's see for example in the first panel here we have exposure so exposure uh, will work with light and shadows uh, dark dark parts and light lightened parts of my scene okay so I can start change this a little bit and also lightness and the contrast okay I'm already affecting a lot this image uh, well you can use this software to improve your image or also to create some you know psychedelic and strange effect you can really alterate the image so it's up to you and also the saturation here I can increase the colors or I can decrease the colors and there you go so I have just made some really quick changes to the original images and also I can zoom like that to have a more closer look to both of them so it's pretty easy to use uh, no doubt on that pretty fast and I will not show you all these panels because we have a lot of stuff going on here but you know the, the same um, the same thing applies to all the other panels more or less and this is how it works in general this is just again an introduction and I hope you am, you have enjoyed this uh, video so thank you for watching thank you very much again see a little bit more of uh, what we do in the YouTube channel and thank you for watching 
see you in the next video guide.